Hey guys, in this video I want to show you how to install the Android uh, 5.0.2 Lollipop on the Samsung Galaxy Note 4. Uh, now this is a very simple tutorial, so be sure that your device is rooted and you are using a SM9 N9-10F model, which is the quad-core Qualcomm model. So if you are using an octa-core model, don't use, uh, use it because you will hard break your device, not soft break, you will hard break your device. Uh, your display might not work or uh, or your device will be completely useless so if you are using octa-core Galaxy Note 4 please stay away uh, so for those who are using international N910F model Qualcomm Snapdragon 805 then you can uh, do this tutorial here so what you need to do is you need to download the CM12 file, uh, file for uh, the uh, Galaxy Note 4 uh, Qualcomm variant here N910F which is TR LDE XX, that's kind of name for this device. So, download that file. Also, download, uh, be sure that you are rooted, you have a custom recovery installed. And uh, you can do this on your phone, like uh, go into your uh, browser, any browser that you use, like this browser, and it, uh, open up the YouTube, my video. If you're watching the video on the, on the Note 4, uh, click on the link in the description download the ROM on your phone or if you can download the ROM uh, on your laptop and uh, connect your device via USB cable and transfer that ROM file, the ROM zip file, CM12 unofficial zip file to your Galaxy Note 4's internal memory and after doing that can uh, disconnect and be sure that you have TWRP or CWM installed uh, power off your device Okay. So, uh, of course, you can see that uh, I am running the Android 5.0.2. If I go to settings about device, you can see this is running the Android 5.0.2. And I can show you the name of the device. This is the name here. Uh, let's focus, focus page. So, this is uh, CM12 unofficial TRLTEXX. This is the name of the N910F uh, model. So, uh, power off your uh, Galaxy Note 4. Four. If you are using the stock ROM or whatever, power off. So when you power off your Galaxy Note 4, what you need to do is you need to hold down the volume up, power and the home key at the same time like this and you will boot up into recovery mode instantly. So when you are in the recovery mode, uh, what you need to do is you need to first do a wipe data factory reset. And uh, if you are using the stock ROM before doing the wipe data factory reset, make sure you make a backup. And after making the backup, then wipe data factory reset and wipe the um, uh, the other stuff. Like uh, if you go to the advanced wipe, you can see we have this option of uh, deadly cache. I do this because uh, the thing is that sometimes Note 4 is uh, just stuck on boot up a logo of Sound Gen Moss, so uh, for that you have to do that. Uh, then, after doing that, you click on install, uh, just scroll down to your uh, root file. You can see this is your root file here. Down below, we have the CM12 unofficial TRLTEXX and the G apps you have to flash after you flash the ROM. So, that's how you install uh, the Sound Gen Mod. Uh, 12 5.0.2 Lollipop, you uh, update your device to the 5.0.2 Lollipop, your Note 4. So, uh, this will come with a little bit of bugs and everything. I will not recommend you to use it as a daily driver right now, uh, but uh, you know, just wait for more updates to come. Uh, but, anyways, this definitely, uh, you, uh, if you want to check it out and have some fun, you can install it, no problem whatsoever. And make a backup of your stock ROM so that you can uh, restore it after. Uh, using the CM12, what I'm going to do right now. Uh, so, uh, thanks so much for checking out this video. I'll see you next one. Peace out.